Hello, everybody. Welcome to the webinar. I'm going to go ahead and put a poll in the chat. You guys want to go ahead and answer that for me? Just asking how you're planning on using Everfit. A little introduction. My name is Joey. I'm a product specialist here at Everfit. My job is to speak to coaches and gym owners to see how Everfit can best suit their business. A little bit of um, structure for the webinar today. I'm going to go ahead and give you a little introduction. I explain our goal as a company, what we're trying to do. I'll switch over to the web platform next and go into some, um, go into more depth about some features on the web platform, show you around. Then we'll open it up to a Q&A. You guys can ask any questions you have for me. Then we can go talk about some more advanced features of the platform and we'll finish with another Q&A. So starting off, our goal is to become an all-in-one fitness platform where they do a one-on-one -on -one coaching, group coaching, on-demand coaching, you can do all that from one place with Everfit. So we have habits. You can make individual program, track their metrics, track nutrition, multiple ways to communicate with your clients, do group coaching and run challenges as well. So the three main use cases, again, that one-on-one -on -one coaching where you make individualized programs for your clients, track individual metrics, from body metrics and workout metrics, track nutrition, nutrition individually, and track their tasks and habits as well. You can do all of that on a group um, training style too, where you kind of put everything all in one place, add clients all into the same calendar and they will all run and receive the same content. And with the one-to-many training kind of on-demand style, you provide your clients with all the content. It's more up to them to complete it at their own pace or on their own time, whenever they have availability. So I'll go ahead and switch over to the web platform now and walk you guys through it. So starting off, there's a couple ways to add clients onto your platform. One is going up here and clicking add client, where you can enter the first, last name, and email, send them an email invitation. If you want to add multiple clients, you can do that as well. You can also add clients by a CSV file to bulk upload clients from like a different platform, for example. Another way to add clients will be down here in the bottom left. You each will have your own custom invite link and you could send out and clients can sign up to your platform from there as well. When you click on a client's name, the first thing you're gonna see is an overview where you can see any training, any body metrics, any habits, notes, injuries, goals, progress photos, or any live updates. With the training tab is where you can see any workouts or programs you've assigned to this client. Here, you can either add a workout you've previously built or add a full program. So here, when you click add a workout, again, you can choose from your library or create a new workout too. So let's say you wanted to build a leg day workout. A great way to start building workouts is adding sections. So with the sections, we have regular, interval, AMRAP, timed, and freestyle. For this example, I'm gonna go ahead and do a regular section and we'll just title the legs. To start looking for exercises, you can type in the name of an exercise here on the left. Find the one you want to use, and you can just drag and drop. Oops. You can also filter. So you can filter by Everfit's exercises, custom exercises, any tags you've created, any categories, or by primary focus as well. Then again, find the exercise you want, and you can just drag and drop. From here, you can enter the weights, you can do rep ranges, add rest times, add sets, superset exercises, and then with these three dots, you can customize the fields. So instead of just weight and reps, you can add in time, speed, distance, RPE, RIR. And you can also add alternate exercises too. And then we also have one rep max feature. We can click use percent. Enter the percent of the client's one rep max. And it'll tell the client what way to do for that set. Once you save this workout, it will just automatically add on to your client's calendar for that day. With the metrics, for the body metrics, we do have integrations with Apple Health, Google Fit, Fitbit, and Garmin. 
So the clients can connect those apps, keep track of their steps, their weight, and their body fat. For the exercise metrics, every time your client completes a workout, it will save. So you can go back in time and track the client's progress throughout the program. For our nutrition features, we have our food journal, which is like a food Instagram, so the clients can post pictures of their meals and you can like and comment on it. With our macros, we have integrations with MyFitnessPal and Chronometer, so the clients can log their foods in one of those two apps, and you can see their macros and calories updated throughout the day as they log more food. And we have a meal plan feature where you can create custom recipes or choose from the recipes we have on the platform, build out meal plans, and assign it to your clients on a calendar basis as well. And then the settings is super customizable, so you can turn on or off any feature of the client app for each client individually. You can control your client's view of the program, allow clients to move around workouts on their own calendar, and you can provide your clients with a list of exercises they can swap out during their workouts too. And lastly here with the task tab, you can assign multiple different types of tasks. One being a general task where you give it a name, you can add media, documents, and links, set reminders for these tasks, and have these tasks repeat. You can have a task for the client to update progress photos, update body metrics. You can assign habits to our platform where you can choose from our list here or create a custom habit. And you can build out forms of questionnaires and assign it to a task as well. So you'll build those forms over here under our library. Once you build these out, you would just save them and then again, you can sign them through that task tab under the client's account. All right, I'm going to open it up to a Q&A. If you guys do have any questions, please feel free to type them in the chat. Now. Hopefully that was pretty clear. A lot of those features are going to be pretty useful for a lot of you guys in here because a lot of those one-on-one -on -one online coaching features are done through the client's account there. Do you have a video library? Yep, Greg. Gregston, sorry. In the library, you can go to exercises, and we do have over 3,500 exercises, and majority of them do have videos attached to them. You can also add your own exercises up here in the top right, where you give it a name, primary focus, some instructions, and you can upload your own video here, or post a YouTube or Vimeo link for an example of that exercise. Please feel free to keep typing those questions, but thank you all for joining. I'm going to go ahead and send some links in the chat. So the first one's going to be our free trial. If you guys haven't started your free trial yet, we do have a 30-day free trial where you have access to every feature on the platform. So definitely take advantage of that. The Facebook group, we do have a very active Facebook group where a lot of our coaches are kind of super helpful and um, I'll communicate through there. The feature suggestions, if you guys have any features you want to see on the platform, you can suggest those Suggest those on our Candy, our website. We have 24-7 customer support you can reach out to over email. And there's also my email down there if you guys have any additional questions after this call today. Feel free to reach out. I'm going to ask me anything you need.